All right, everybody. This is Ray. Ray, get upright for me, would you? All right. No, get upright. No, 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 upright. No, no, upright. <laughs> Does it hurt? Go ahead, put your hands on the thing. Is is that hard to do? Pretty hard. Okay. It's a good lower back workout. Is, is that a pod that you're uh, you're in? You're just gonna use this. Okay, too. okay. I just want to see now. Let's let's try it. Let's see what the next. Let's cut the video and then we'll do a little change and see if uh, if it makes any difference. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right. So rate right, any difference. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right. So rate right, any difference. Okay, okay. This is Mark Lillydahl's harness that he flew for years. Now, do you notice any difference at all in your uprightness? Well, my lower back doesn't kill itself trying to keep upright. What was that exactly, did you say? Oh, my lower back's not killing itself trying to stay upright. Oh, that's interesting. Well, I'll tell you from, from this point, I really can't tell a difference, can you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm being sarcastic. Look how much more upright he is. So this is like a training harness. For, it's like a training harness and advanced harness all together. So go ahead. So fly around, man. Just imagine landing like that. Look how easy it's going to be. Oh, yeah. Okay, now let's see if you can get into this yeah, thing. Say, okay, so uh, undo that. Okay. Now the way you do this is, no, you, you get your knee on the outside. Your knee on the outside. And then you just kind of do a yoga move. You go kind of like this. Yeah, like that. Good. But you can't use your hands. Well, that's fine. okay. For now he can. For now he can. Then well, so yeah, try try to try to make your body go in, in forward in the harness. Yeah. Oh. There you go. <laughs> yeah, just just as temporary. I'll teach you how to do it. Okay, good. Oh, cool. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, you look like a ridge rat. You look like a freaking ridge rat. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> All right. So give me some turns. Show me how to turn. Here, wait, here. Well, so anyway, I'm going to show Brendan. Me. He's looking good in his, uh, in his pod, uh, Will's Wing Z5, right? Something like that. Yeah. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to look in the mirror, right? Mm -hmm. And you're going to, uh, give me a turn. Let's see if you do it right. That's pretty good. You don't necessarily have to pull in today. Yeah. So what you want to do is, okay, do it, do it some more. Yeah, that, that's pretty good. Do you feel pressure there? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I think what Takeo is seeing here is he's seeing your feet move uh, a little more than he likes them to move, which, you know, this is not cross-controlling. Cross-controlling is where you do this. Wait, hold on. Yeah, that, that looked good. Cross-controlling is this. No, no, no. Okay. It's just, it's just twi twist in the, in the control frame. That's cross-controlling. Right. Yeah, I think that's. So what, what you're doing is you're you're moving your your feet a little too far for for Takeo's oh, okay. happiness. So try to keep your body as straight as possible. Look at yourself in the mirror, it's because you'll never have this chance to see yourself in real time. So yeah, just try to keep try to keep your feet in line. There you go. Nice. Is, is that really the way to do it? Yep. Takeo Takeo will will like that. Oh. Yeah. Do it. Do it again. There you go. Yeah. Okay, so so what's the, the, the thing that people do that's, that's not right? The thing that you did uh, before. So that, that's bad. Because okay. that's not going to do anything. You right, know, I'd rather see I'm not your, shifting my weight. You're not, yeah. you're, just, you're just twisting the control frame. Okay. Right, but if and you... If, the thing if you, that I was doing wrong when we were tandeming together, what was that? You were doing that, the, what you just did. You were doing that, yep. And, that, and I taught you to lead with your feet, and um, maybe you're just doing it a little bit too much. Yeah, so don't, try to keep your body straight. Look at, your, look at yourself in the mirror. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. You know, as long as you're feeling pressure on the, on the base bar, you know, that, right. that's, that's, that, now you're not feeling pressure. I'm, yeah, I'm feeling the inertia of my body. But yeah, but you're not feeling the, the pressure on, on, on your, your, uh, hands, yeah. you know, and that's what's going to, it's because that's how you know your weight's shifting is when you feel that, that pressure. Yeah. No, you're good. All right, so this is Brendan in this upright position. So even even though you are uh, okay as far as uprightness goes, if you had a cocoon, you would be even more upright. But you're you're doing good. So it's, this is not the time to change uh, drastic stuff in the beginning. You want to kind of keep everything nice flare. Actually, I got to practice the other thing that Takeo was telling you. Let's just keep your legs back when you're flaring. Oh yeah. Yeah. So, coming in, yeah. And then, 
That'll that'll stop the glider. Yep. If you right. knock that over, that means you did good. Yeah, because because I what I was doing is I noticed I was. You put your feet forward. Flare, and then yeah. Oh, oh, my I, feet. Yeah. Like flies forward and. And all that does is makes you keep put your weight forward. Yeah. Yeah, that's correct. <laughs>